sidewalk. If you do so voluntarily, no charges will be placed against you. If you remain in the roadway and refuse to utilize the sidewalk, you will be placed under arrest and charged with we're live here at the end at the anti Dakota Access Pipeline rally here in New York City. The police now are ordering all protesters to leave the road. They blocked off the street completely. No charges will be placed against you. If you remain in the roadway and refuse to utilize the sidewalk, you will be placed under arrest and charged. Good here? Are we good here? Okay, so there are hundreds of people in the street right now, and people are beginning to sit down and risk arrest in an act of civil disobedience outside the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers office. And the message here is telling the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers to stand down. Stand down and, and stand with Standing Rock stand with the water protectors and really asking the Army Corps of Engineers to lead from a place of moral justice. And My name is LJ and I'm an, a direct action organizer. And LJ, why are you here today? Can you tell us exactly why the mass action and why you chose today? The mass action today was called by a group called Indigenous Environmental Network who put out the call as today as a national day of action against the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. In response to this action, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers put out a statement last night saying that they were going to stop and reconsider the pipeline construction in light of the environmental impact and in light of the historical impact of the dispossession of indigenous people. So there's stop there's there is currently no construction happening. They're going to discuss with the with the Standing Rock Sioux tribe what's going on. And uh, we're trying to keep the pressure on the US Army Corps of Engineers right now. So right now if I can describe the police are right here in front of us. They're uh guard can show the protesters here. Back it up, back it up, let's go, back it up. threatening the protesters, threatening arrest to all protesters here who as you can see are sad down on the road, blocking the roadway. If you can see there's at least, I would say, a dozen or more protesters here on the street. I would say there's about 30 to 40 people there. Right now we're refusing to move. As you can see, the protesters sat down or refusing to leave. Police are now forcing us to move down also onto the sidewalk. We have to go right here. Thank you, water protectors! Back up, guys, back up, back up, back up. Back up. Back up. Get on the sidewalk. Get on the sidewalk. Get on the sidewalk. The whole world is watching. 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 The whole world is watching! 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 
additional crimes. Since you have refused to leave the roadway, you will be placed under arrest on the charge of disorderly conduct. If you do not form a as you can see, there's a group of about 20 now, sat down, surrounded by police. A few of them were arrested there in the back. They're refusing to leave. This protest, there's around a thousand protesters here at Foley Square in downtown Manhattan. Jay, can you take us through quickly what's going on? So what's Booty happening right protect. now is Booty there are about 50 people Booty who are sitting sir. in the middle of the, of the sidewalk, Booty I'm sorry, in the middle sir. of the street. Arrests have just started. Booty people are peacefully sir. holding Booty space. Sir. People are singing. People are praying. People are standing with the water protectors. Um, and I see, I see right now how powerfully people are in song. And so people are going to refuse to leave until they are forced to do so because this is happening in 200 cities right now across the country. So arrests are starting right now. Back up.
after arresting all the demonstrators on the ground. They're being surrounded. We're not allowed right now to cross the street. Again, there are several hundred here on the side of this street. They were just at a rally at Foley Square in downtown Manhattan where about, I would say, one to two thousand gathered to protest the Dakota Access Pipeline in North Dakota. And here, and here you'll see several, you can see several people here being questioned by police. Many have already been arrested. Many, many, many police here. Again, we are not allowed to cross. The best view we can give you of those demonstrating on the street in front of us is right here. Police are prohibiting everyone, even press, to cross the street. The whole world is watching. The whole world is watching. 
I am here with Nicole. She's a veteran who came out here today. She was at the U.S. Army Corps Engineer's office right here across the street. She was there this morning to present a letter uh, demanding uh, what the protests here are demanding, basically for the Corps to come out uh, with the Environmental Review to come out against Energy Transfer Partners, the company building the Dakota Access Pipeline. Nicole, what was the response like today at the, at the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers office? Um, the response today at the Army Corps of Engineers office was a promising one. There have been many pipelines shut down before. In fact, we were assured due to um, different gatherings such as these with different water protectors all across the nation that our grievances will be heard. The EPA is investigating as we speak the Dakota pipeline. So it seems like our actions are working. And Nicole, as a veteran coming here today, what type of significance does that hold for you? Um, for me as a veteran, the significance is great. I feel as an Iraqi, um, a former Iraqi um, soldier, I was on the wrong side of history. Now I feel that I'm on the right side of history as a mother, as a citizen of the United States, and as a water protector. All right, thank you. I'm gonna sign off now, but again, we are at the Standing Rock anti Dakota Access Pipeline protest here in New York City, where the police are still holding back the crowd. Signing off for now.